the reception of a Kepler song was finally positive, at least as positive as Up. I'm very happy that people are recognizing the group's value in the industry as it stands, but I feel like a lot of people are focusing on Galileo's sonic qualities or the concept of the music video. I want to talk about the actual lyrical content of the song because while it's not an overly complex song, I think the idea is really cool for lack of better terms. Kepler really said, actually we're God, but like such a benevolent God that they want to come down to the human level and experience things the way the person they call Galileo does. The song begins with a beautiful snippet of Yeso. I did not know she could sound like that, but oh my god, she sounded great. That's off topic though. She establishes the two parties are looking at each other, but the way she words it portrays them as sort of above the subject. It's like their their presence is a given, like they are omnipresent and above this human realm, but they also want to engage with humanity, talking about discovering things together. The song is an apostrophe, meaning it addresses someone not present as the song addresses Galileo, and they sort of toy with how they both truly know what love is. They also toy with surf surface level emotions, stating their deep love makes them prettier. These are not the words of your typical godlike figure. It makes things like the scientific method seem intimate, like when they ask a question at the beginning of the chorus, like this is an experiment they intend to perform. They say to look at their heart, seemingly a reference to Galileo's invention of the telescope, but they also state their heart is filled with hearts. To me, this implies their heart is truly a galaxy with all of these quote unquote hearts to look at. And they say they'll let them go out the window, situating the speaker in some kind of physical space, allowing the unnatural to connect to the natural and seemingly relinquishing some of their own control. In the second verse, they acknowledge the, their status as two, a pair, kind of bringing the speaker down to the subject's level. Their feelings are also treated as proof, making something more abstract into something concrete. They also aren't going to hide because what's the point? They're omnipresent. As the song goes on, they treat Galileo with even more intimacy. They want to prove what love is, a bit stronger of a term than just define, and they present this as a joint effort. The orange sky further implicates this state of transition the speaker is going through. By admitting the subject is all they think about, they sort of throw omniscience out the window. They talk about the mind swirling, this confused abstract imagery, but they suggest stepping out into the unknown, truly stepping into this human realm like it's worth more to live a human life and love rather than being a literal god. It's like the reverse of no exit and I kind of love it. Let me know what you think if you interpreted the song differently, but I'd also be interested in learning about any songs you find deceptively interesting. I want to look into a lot of songs that people sometimes overlook when talking about truly interesting lyrics.